Hello and welcome to the Bible Bro Ministries telecast. I'm your Bible brother, Patrick Carradine, walking you through God's Word, one scripture at a time. Today's scripture reading will come from Genesis 5th chapter, first verse through the 32nd verses. So let's get started. Here's the written story of Adam's family line. When God created man, he made him in his own likeness. He created them as male and female. He blessed them and he called them man when they were created. When Adam was 130 years old, he had a son in his own likeness. He named him Seth. Adam lived 800 years after Seth was born. He also had other sons and daughters. Adam lived a total of 930 years. Then he died. Seth lived 105 years. Then he became the father of Enosh. Seth lived 807 years after Enosh was born. He also had other sons and daughters. Seth lived a total of 912 years, then he died. Enosh lived 90 years, then he became the father of Kenan. Enosh lived 815 years after Kenan was born. He also had other sons and daughters. Enosh lived a total of 905 years, then he died. Kenan lived 70 years, then he became the father of Mahalalel. Kenan lived 840 years after Mahalalel was born. He also had other sons and daughters. Kenan lived a total of 910 years, then he died. Mahalalel lived 65 years, then he became the father of Jared. Mahalalel lived 830 years after Jared was born. He also had other sons and daughters. Mahalalel lived a total of 895 years, then he died. Jared lived 162 years, then he became the father of Enoch. Jared lived 800 years after Enoch was born. He also had other sons and daughters. Enoch lived 65 years, then he became the father of Methuselah. Enoch walked with God 300 years after Methuselah was born. He also had other sons and daughters. Enoch lived a total of 365 years. Enoch walked with God. Then he couldn't be found because God took him from this life. Methuselah lived 187 years. Then he became the father of Lamech. Methuselah lived 782 years after Lamech was born. He also had other sons and daughters. Methuselah lived a total of 969 years. Then he died. Lamech lived 182 years, then he had a son. He named him Noah. Lamech said, he will comfort us when we are working. He'll comfort us when our hands work so hard they hurt. We have to work hard. That's because the Lord has put a curse on the ground. Lamech lived 595 years after Noah was born. He also had other sons and daughters. Lamech lived a total of 777 years, then he died. After Noah was 500 years old, he became the father of Shem, Ham, and Japheth. I have just read to you Genesis 5th chapter, first verse through the 32nd verses. This has been a Bible Bro Ministries telecast. I'm your Bible brother, Patrick Carradine, walking you through God's Word, one scripture at a time. Have a blessed day.